Good afternoon. Good evening, everybody, and welcome to the um, to the turf today as Burnley take on Everton. Ninth against 14th. Two teams that are reasonably very much where they should not be at the moment in, at this moment in time. Burnley, of course, have decided to point with Neymar up top, which means Bojan gets a recall. We'll go for the team in more detail in a moment, but he is the player, one of the players that Everton really have to watch, like Hawk, like Hawk, if they are going to have a success today, the Toffees. Burnley are lying ninth, may have to make two two changes. Neymar comes up, well, he'll make one change. Bojan comes in, and Neymar goes up front to replace the stricken Mario Balotelli, who, as you know, is out for four months. As for Roberto Martinez's underperforming side, Stenek is the goalkeeper, Romelu Lukaku is the man up front, Barkley in behind, Delefeo and Morales are two dynamos on each side, and they have to be watched like Hawks. Jones and Mori are the two centre-backs. So, a new strike partnership forced upon Stutzi with that injury to Bonatelli in St. Petersburg on Wednesday night referee today Jonathan Moss will get us away in just a second and it's the Clarence of Burnley who'll get this game away rain, mist, fog you name it here and it's bitterly cold as well to boot in late November so Bojan back in the side Here's Trippier. Nick Moray. Lucas is in there. Clearing it away. Smelts his header. Della fail. Barkley to Lukaku. Stones up against his old side today. Scored in the defeat at Stoke last week. Hughes. Good try. Good save. Stenek. Good start from the Clarence, needing to respond well after what's been a week to forget. Redmond's corner. Good out of Rodriguez, good save, still not away, Hughes, charge down. Is that a penalty? No, not a penalty. Well, that kids had gone down illegally in the penalty box, but the referee's not giving it, and suddenly we've got Delafeo at the other end. He's got a couple of Everton shirts in the middle. And Lukaku, good save, Jack Butland. What a great action there in 60 seconds. Barely thought they'd scored at one end and maybe had a penalty shout. And then Lukaku with a volley, well tipped away. Everton corner, here it comes. And I had a hole and he's flicked over the top by Lukaku. Well, he's had two presentable chances in at least 30 seconds. So both goalkeepers pressed into service in this opening 20 minutes. Smell saying very well. Here's Rodriguez. Ings touching it on. Bojan. On to Redmond. Ings has stayed on side. Flags, Lysman's kept the flag down. That's a good ball. And Neymar! Halfway through the first half. Deadlock is broken and it was only a question of time. And Lukaku will now pay big time for those two missed chances. Neymar has had his first and has taken it from six yards. And he's coming for Balotelli up front. And it's took his chance superbly. Neymar Jr. 1-0 Burnley. And the Brazilian strikes only his third of the season. Neymar now. Good ball. And Ings is on to it. And Ings will try. Right foot. And Stenek with a save. Really good bit of goalkeeping there. But it was going wide. Redmond's corner. Stanek with a good fist. Trippier tries the shot. There's a deflection on it. 
and it is a corner came off Lucas last Redmond again Mori with a header away now here's a chance for Lukaku and he's through and everyone pulled forward for Burnley and now the goalkeeper had to come out narrow the angle and Lukaku is blasted it over he's had three of these opportunities yes three and he's missed a lot Subatic oh McCarthy now that's going to be a free kick referee going across and will book Subatic for that so Nevin Subatic is the first name into the referee's notepad John Moss taking the decision that uh, it was late on uh, James McCarthy yes he did we, well the replay clearly concludes that he does trip him now Burnley looked consumingly in command last week against Stoke and then blew the lead they can't afford to do the same again this week and Everton trying to keep it alive with Lucas Jones is in there the centre back last minute of the first half McCarthy Morales away from Sepetic's challenge in Butland with a very confident and a short catch and it's bowled out straight to Redmond on for Ings now the captain Rodriguez Ings keeps possession Bojan right foot and Stanek could only parry and Jones pulls it away corner kick we're deep into those five added minutes now Redmond win it he'll get a second bite he heads it back in there smelts to trying to shot and again the goalkeeper didn't hold on Danny Ings we still play on not anymore we don't but it's a lead for Burnley it's a slender one Lukaku missed three glorious chances but the goal from Neymar halfway through the first half separates these two evenly matched sides Burnley won Everton nil so away we go then at turf ball no changes from either side Everton kicking uh, oh, the second half off and attacking the goal to our right in the blue shirts with Lukaku who missed three glorious opportunities he's played it in towards Morales there was a deflection on the cross and then it's somehow a bit of a mix up and Butland has to let it go for a corner ricochets off Trippier there and it's somehow smuggled behind so Delafeo with the corner floated in and Murray first real chance of the second half and it fell to the men from Merseyside couldn't keep the header down and just look at the rain now he's bucketing down his steroid uh, steroid sorry the pitch still looks in very very good condition despite all this rain we're getting here and here's Hughes good try oh the goalkeeper did hold it and got away with it well that looked a very simple formality for Stanek it was straight out in the shot from Hughes but he didn't do it at all well with it corner to Burnley Walsh is replaced by Cleverly Stanek this time with a decisive fist Trippier with a shot back in and again this time he catches very well Lukaku's flick Barkley Everton attacking with intent Lukaku had a much better option further forward there's a P Everton player gone tumbling there off the ball but Burnley have it Neymar whose goal divides the teams on a wet and wild afternoon here in deepest Lancashire Redmond will test the test the strength of this Everton defence once again that's a good run but the cross didn't match the ambition 25 minutes of the game 
Smelts that. And the ball just holds up enough for Rodriguez to keep it in, but he's lost it. Taylor Fell has stolen in here for Everton. Stone, Supertich. Bit of a mix up. Barkley heads over. What a chance for Ross Barkley. It's been again really littered by missed chances for both sides. Real theme of the game. Danny Inks. Redmond. Oh, skip past the defender. That's a better cross. And a goal for use! Daylight between the Currents and the Toffees. And Will Hughes. He came in at the back stick and from three yards out, wasn't going to miss that. Stanek, a beaten goalkeeper, and Burnley have got themselves clear daylight from Everton now. 2 0. And Hughes gets his foot of the season after 76 minutes. Inside the last 10 minutes, Oviedo still. And the shot over the top. McCarthy back to deflected. It's a corner. So Della failed to take this corner. Barkley's flick and it's loose. And it's not away properly, but Danny Inks can get it fully away. And look at the break on here. If Rodriguez plays this right, Neymar is through. Neymar is through now. Just him and the goalkeeper to beat. And Stenick did well. Well, there's going to be plenty of highlights in this one, that's for sure. Extended highlights speak to mind. Here's Lukaku. But then not very far getting in away. Here's Cleverly. Oh, good ball. It's Delafeo! Everton have missed another chance. And that's been the story of their afternoon. Another poor miss. McCarney on for Barkley. Oviedo's header. McCarthy, is there a consolation goal for the Toffees? Who have played really well themselves, but just haven't took the chances. There might be a third in the off here because Neymar has sprung the offside trap yet again. Oh, he's trying to be too deliberate about it, but he's found the net! 3 0! Fourth goal this season. He tried to be too deliberate, but he had the time, he had the skills, and thrashed it into the net. Right in the corner. Game, set, match. Ever Burnley over Everton, 3 0. And as I say, four goals this season. A remarkable effort. And Everton now a beaten side. And the whistle has gone. And I tell you what, 3-0 does not reflect what really went on this afternoon. It really didn't. Both sides could have had four. Four goals each. It was that it could have been that close. But Burnley ran out 3-0 winners. But it was far from convincing. Two goals for Neymar. The other one in between from Will Hughes. And he looks like a very good replacement for Balotelli for the next four months. But Burnley needed that victory after two defeats in the week. Everton gave it their all. Could have had three or four themselves, conceivably. But it's Burnley who take the spoils. Winners today by three goals to nil. What a crucial victory. And they needed that victory. I'm so pleased this punch. You could tell by the emotional commentary towards the end when that third one went in from Neymar that 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 result meant so much Burnley now up to 6th position that's the 7th game 1 out of 14 but crucially we've lost 5 and we've only drawn 2 matches um, 
But we're on 23 points. We're in sixth place. We're a point behind Manchester United. But even more significant than that, we're now two points behind West Bromwich Albion in fourth position. And that's where you want to be, the top four. But we are, though, nine points behind new leaders, Liverpool, who... Um, Go one point clear of Manchester City. Everton, for the record, stay 14th. So they don't move up or down any positions at all in the table. The bottom three are Hull, QPR and Watford. So that's very much it for this particular episode. We're now moving to December, a busy time of the year. Let's see what we've got to look forward to because it's going to be a very busy month month before the January window. Obviously, we started December with that win over Everton. Uh, we've got to go to... We've got a game against Southampton at St Mary's. And then we've got Celtic at Turf Moor in the Battle of Britain. You'll see highlights of this. All these games you'll see. Uh, then we've got to go uh, to Turf. We play at Turf again against West Brom. And then we're once again at home. So we've got three games at home in three different competitions. That's in the League Cup quarterfinals. And then before, the game before Christmas, we're at Carroll Road. Three days before Christmas. After Christmas on the 29th, we're at home to QPR. And finishing the month and the year, with a calendar year, with a trip to Old Trafford. So plenty of big games to look out for in the next month. So that could shape our season. And of course, the start of the window and then another away match with Liverpool and another away match with Man City. So we've got three away matches in a row in the Premier League. And then obviously we're back four. Make that four in a row because we've got to go to Villa Park as well. And then and then we're back at home again on the 20th of January next year against Crystal Palace. But that's all from now for this week. Uh, for this video at least. Uh, I hope very much you've enjoyed it. Um, to be honest with you, 3 0, it could have been even. It could have ended at 3 all to be quite honest. Everton did have chances, or Kaku had a hat trick of chances and just didn't take them. But we're very pleased with the victory. Neymar looks a very good replacement uh, short term as a striker. He will drop into midfield once Balotelli hits fit again. But two goals for Neymar, one for Hughes, and Burley again in the right directions. Thank you for watching. Please do leave a like. Please subscribe if you haven't already to the channel, JB Claret 1983 uh, If you want to tweet me, my address is um, at stutzy83 at twitter.com. I'll be delighted to hear from you then. Until then, I'll see you for the Southampton game. Until then, I'll see you soon. And uh, keep subscribing. And let's see if we can get up to that 1,400 subscriber mark. Until then, take care. I'll see you later. ta now. Bye-bye.